Hello, quick video. I got this faucet and the the hose was getting stuck. I would pull it, but it wouldn't pull back, and it was really hard to pull it from the bottom, or the, or pull it out, or pull it in. So what I saw is that this part spins separate from this part, and when it does that, it moves the hoses in the inside. So you twist it, and you see the hose, you can see the hose, well actually in that hole has to be the hose for the sprayer, and that gets in the way and it gets really hard to pull it. So, so my hose can run free, but I'm going to have to mark this one with a sharpie in this part or somehow I'm gonna have to mark it so I can see that it so, so I can see that it doesn't move because if it moves those hoses are gonna move and are gonna be on the way of the sprayer hose so now the hoses are gonna be on the right I'm gonna make sure when I'm installing it at the bottom that my hoses are on the right that way this one can run freely like this otherwise it feels like he's just scratching and it's just it's just a headache it's gotta run smooth and if it doesn't run smooth that's because these hoses are on the way and we're gonna, you know this doesn't have to move freely goes back down uh, well you see the ball the ball on the right side that's the old one from my old faucet so I reused it on this one so it puts weight on this side so now I can pull it and it goes right back and it's on. Oh, I like it. But before it was just scratching, it was like I was pulling it and it would stay. And I would have to put it from the bottom. And that's because of that, because it gets twisted and the other hoses get on the way of the sprayer hose. If you have that problem, that's what it was. Thank you for watching. Good night or good afternoon, wherever you are. Bye.